All right, guys, Faith from Boxing Evolution TV, and I'm just here to interview Stan Wilson, who is having a rematch against Schwan Bodosti. Uh, you fought Schwan before on IFC. Um, you didn't get the decision. It was a good fight. Um, I personally gave probably the first two rounds to Schwan in the last round to you, where he started to get a bit gassed, and uh, your punches started to you know, get the better of him. Um, what's going to be different this time? Well, this time round, I haven't taken the fight at 12 hours' notice. I've had a, a four-week training camp to prepare for it. Yeah, I'd just like to know, add on that. Uh, Stan got a lot, was put in as a last-minute replacement for that fight, weren't you, yeah, last time? 12 hours. Um, this time, I've had four weeks to prepare. As you can see, I'm in a buzzing gym. Um, yeah, I, I personally don't think um, Sean's going to know what's going to hit him. Uh, a, fit, a fit Stan Wilson is a very strong Stan Wilson. I think I'll be too strong for him on the night. Now, I mean, what have you? What type of training have you done? You know, to, to, to deal with his kicks better because that was what seemed to give you a bit of trouble last time. Um, well, basically, uh, I've just been working, take, taking the kicks, and then uh, learning on how to how to throw combinations after I've blocked the kicks. Um, so check counter. Yeah, yeah, check check out, and um, and I think I've got the tools now to to put put off the win. I genuinely do believe I will uh, win that fight. Now, um, you've had how much notice for this fight? Four uh, weeks? We've had about four, four, four and a half weeks um, since, since we got the call. Uh, I'm not sure how long Sean, Sean's had, but to me, four weeks is long enough uh, to get myself fit and, and ready. Well, if you're happy to take a fight at, at 12 uh, hours notice, then four weeks definitely should be long enough, shouldn't it? Yeah, yeah, without a shadow of a doubt. I mean, like I said, we're at a buzzing gym. We're training six times a week. Um, yeah, I'll be ready on the fight night. Now this fight is slightly different, isn't it? It's only 90 second rounds as opposed to two minute rounds. Yeah, um, which I think will benefit both of us, um, obviously because we're both heavy guys. Uh, so that 30 seconds less, I, I, I think we'll both uh, benefit from that. I, I, don't, I don't think it'll be easier on either one fight. I think it'll benefit both of us combined. So it'll still make for an entertaining fight. Well, definitely, I think you're both going to be going more at it, and especially in the first round, perhaps, to try and get that first round. Yeah, I, I, I think the, the pair of us, we're both similar fighters. Um, I, we both like to try and hold the centre of the ring and, and both try and let, let our shots go. Um, so I think it will be an entertaining fight. I think it'll be very entertaining. I think it'll be better than the first one. Yeah. Now, I think that it was actually your boxing footwork last time that gave Sean a bit of trouble trying to land punches on you because any time he got set ready to throw the kick, you were gone. You know, yeah. Is that not something you're going to take advantage of this time? Well, well, I mean, no, no. Sean, Sean's a great fighter, so no doubt he, he's he's obviously worked on that as well as I've worked on blocking the kicks. So I do believe that my footwork will be better than his, but on the same hand, I don't think it'll be as easy for me to move than the last fight. I mean, Sean's a professional fighter as well, so I mean, he's not a silly fighter. So he would have watched the fight back and, and he would have tra trained on that. I would have thought, but yeah. I, I, like I say, I'm happy. I'm happy with my footwork. I'm happy with my, my stand. It's, it's going to be an entertaining fight. It really is. I don't think I've watched any of your fights that aren't entertaining. So. I, like, I, I like to entertain. Um, everybody pays their money to come and watch a fight that's entertaining. If you're not entertaining, then there's, there's no. You've got no business being in a ring or a cage. Well, I'm looking forward to catching up with Schwan and uh, seeing what he's got to say on the matter. Now, when is your fight? It's next Friday, I believe. Yeah, it's uh, Friday the 3rd uh, of October at the Troxy on WCMMA. Okay. And I noticed as well you were training there with Ollie Sines, who's actually Luke Sines' brother. Yeah, uh, well, I mean... Is that Jake Sines? I get confused. <laughs> I, I, I don't really know. Uh, <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it, it is a Sines, uh, and, and anybody that knows anything about the sport knows the Sines come from a good pedigree of K1 fighters. So, uh, I mean, I've had great sparring for it. So, yeah, it's been good. OK, and if anyone wants to get tickets for your fight or anything like that, where can they uh, get, get hold of them? Get, get hold of me on my Facebook at Stanley Wilson. Um, just send me an inbox. Uh, tickets are £30 or £40. Um, send me a message and I'll get straight back to you. Okay. Alternately, guys, if you can't find Sean, um, Stan, give, give me a message at Boxing Evolution and I'll get hold of a ticket for you. Uh, and if you want to see Sh uh, Stan's last fight against Sean, you can go to www.boxingevolution.tv and go to the IFC promoter channel. You can see uh, Sean versus Stan round one. And I believe that uh, you also would like to have a third fight with Sean if you win this one. Yeah, I mean, obviously, if I, if, if, if I win this one, and it's a big if, um, that'll make it one all. So I think a deciding fight would only be fair. Um, but like I say, that's if I, I, I win this one. I, I, I'm not. I'm not looking ahead of this fight. Okay. All right, guys. Well, this is Stan Wilson. He's uh, definitely a brawler you want to watch, and uh, I look forward to catching up with Sean to see what he's got to say. Anyway, it's Flay from Boxing Evolution TV. Over and out.